Hello, welcome back to the channel and our journey going through some breathing practices. So today we're going to be doing bellows breath or bastrika. This is another great one for energizing. So great for first thing in the morning, during that midday slump, or even before your workout. Now, this can be beneficial as well to boost your mood. If you are suffering from anxiety and depression, this can also be helpful. If you have high blood pressure or um, anything like that, I would advise seeing a doctor before you practice this. So for this one, the exhale is very forceful and then the inhale is very forceful. So traditionally, the arms just reach up and you pull down. So it's kind of like a... Now, I like to breathe in through my nose and out through my mouth. It just feels a little bit more of a releasing. So we'll do that one. And I sometimes I like to do this standing. I'm sitting at the moment. You can do it standing while you're bending and straightening the legs as well. So we'll do five rounds where you breathe in and out, arms going up on the inhale, come down on the exhale. Then we'll do five rounds and scoot back where you bring the arms forward and then you exhale forcefully like you're pulling something back. So you inhale like you're serving and then exhale, really pull it back. Five rounds there. Then we're going, so what you're trying to do is create this warmth of energy around your body. And so it is said that it can create a sense of energetic prana or life force in the body. Um, if you are energized afterward, I think it's doing its job. So another thing I like to do is adding it with a different movement. So for instance, inhale, really expand out. I have my bookshelf here. Open up through the heart, maybe squeeze the shoulders. Inhale, forcefully exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, arms up, exhale, hands to the heart. So we'll try that also for five rounds. So let's take a deep cleansing breath in through the nose. Release out of the mouth. Ready? Five rounds, reaching up. So you might already feel that you're getting warm. Be careful if you feel like you're getting lightheaded. Maybe you need to slow this down a little bit. So now five rounds, bringing the arms forward and back. Feel good? All right, now arms out, inhale. Got my bookshelf here. Breathe in. So that's with breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. So let's try three rounds where you just breathe in through the nose and out through the nose and just see the difference. Maybe it feels better for you. Maybe it feels more constricting. Just notice and be aware of what's going on and see what works for your body. So three rounds with the arms reaching up and pulling down. Now three rounds with the arms pulling forward. Three rounds, arms out. Awesome. Now you can continue this. Maybe you only like the arms reaching up and pulling down. Maybe you only like the arms reaching out and pulling back. Maybe you only like the arms out and coming up. Another one that I really like to do, I'm going to come to kneeling on my knees. So again, you could do this kneeling on your knees with a cushion or blanket under your knees, or you could do this standing where you sort of pull the energy up. So you're actively pulling the energy down actively pulling the energy in, then actively pulling the energy up. So let's just do the, let's do three here, three here, three here, no breaks in between. And then we'll close with a couple deep cleansing breaths and namaste. Ready? Breath in. Deep breath out. Let's do that one more time. Breathe in. And out. Bring hands to heart center. The light in me sees the light in each of you. Namaste. Thank you so much for breathing with me. I hope you feel a little bit more energized, ready to face the rest of your day. And the beauty about these breathing practices is not only will it give you energy, but it can also bring a sense of calm and equilibrium. So I hope you all have a wonderful day and I'll see you next time.
Thank you for checking out this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you're getting stronger in your yoga practice each week. Like this video and subscribe for weekly yoga videos and comment down below on videos that you would like to see in the future. And if you're looking to deepen your practice, you need help with nutrition coaching or even strength and conditioning, check out my website at michellehensonharris.com. The link will be down below for all of my coaching packages. And if you're also looking for exclusive content sent to your inbox each week, such as blog posts, recipes, breakdown of certain yoga postures, then subscribe to my email list at the website as well, michellehensonharris.com. Again, thank you so much and namaste.